Welcome back to another episode of Pete's Gold Adventures. Um, today it's an excellent day. It's going to be about 19, 20 degrees here in uh, central Victoria. And today we're actually out the Whipstick. Uh, Whipstick is a uh, gold bearing area uh, north of Bendigo. So um, today I'm at a place where it's actually where I found my first patch back in the uh, I suppose early 2000s. Um, yeah, so it's a pretty special place for me. Um, I've been out several times and basically flog the crap out of it and uh yeah gold's pretty thin on the ground out here now it's uh it's what it used to be but um yeah but it is a spot that i know that it's some pretty low mineralized um gold digging so um i've got old bazaar over here he's um having a crack at the diggings over here um with the monster so hopefully he'll be able to sort of pick something up today so i sort of give you a little bit of a pan so the whip stick it's pretty dense sort of stuff and around but yeah there's a bit of a bit of alluvial diggings coming down here and they're pretty white so hopefully the mineralization will be pretty well and um yeah the little bazaar over there can pick his uh first piece up with his monster so it sort of just runs off around that way so all right guys well i'm gonna get stuck into it now i'm gonna give a sadie coil a bit of a crack around here and um see what we can come up with and yeah hopefully we'll get you a live dig but um, yeah, I have hit this place up pretty hard, so we'll see what happens. No worries. All right, cheers. Alrighty, guys. I've only walked a couple meters. I've got a little target here. It wasn't very loud until we gave it a bit of a scrape, but um, I gave it a balance and it's still here, so. Just out here on the edge. So give it a bit, a bit of a dig. It's sort of basically on the edge of an old timer's digging here. It's pretty sandy, so hopefully it stays in the ground, otherwise it's gonna be lead shot for sure. Go. First target. First target. Old mate lead shot. So lead shot number one. I reckon we're gonna find a few of those today. Alrighty guys, I'll keep cracking around here and see what we come up with. So the, like the diggings over yonder, they're not too bad. Like it's what they've dug up. It's quiet, the ground on top, there's not so much. Oh, that's a good number. Yeah, that's probably what sort of piqued my interest a bit more. Oh, mate, lead shot. All right, that's lead shot number two. So we're on the count again. Alrighty, guys, just had a bit of a random scrape here. I have found gold in the area, so it's just really thick leaf litter. So I gave this a bit of a scrape. Um, it's a little bit of a loud one. But it's made it through the scrape and it's made it through another inch of sort of crap off the top, but uh, I 
don't know, sounds a bit 22-like. Nice, awesome day. Don't know how many more of these we'll get before the weather turns cold. just smashed to pieces, I couldn't believe it. Just for the shape it is, I thought that was gold. Sound a bit of lead. I don't know how the lead gets so mushed. It, it's definitely the wrong colour. Oh, I couldn't believe it. See something sort of that sort of shape, I think you're on for sure. But that is just a piece of crunched up lead. Go okay, guys, welcome back. Oh, it's been a while. Um, Went back and had some lunch, and whilst I was doing that, um, I sort of pop out with a monster. Um, I picked up three bits of lead shot, so that's five for the day, but um, got something here. Probably lead shot. But um, I thought I might as well get it on the, get it on the uh, whole camera, just in case it was something a bit special. I've actually found two bits of gold off of this back in the day so you never know <laughs> and there we go actually <laughs> first gold with this monster <laughs> which is pretty cool there we go <laughs> in monster fashion it's quite the opposite of the monster it's tiny so there we go this heap is uh paid off once again so that is going to be like a 0.05 at best so but all good it's gold so i'm happy um i was determined to have a crack with this monster today on these um heaps so this one's produced now three bits of gold so all good glad uh we've got that one on film because yeah i'd already done three lead shots and i thought oh bugger i'm gonna put one on so that's all cool, so a nice little shiny nugget there. All right, guys, I'll keep working top of this and see if I can come up with some more. No worries, catch you on the next one. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, anyone who hasn't experienced the monster, um, I've got a little bit of lead shot. It's what they probably called bird shot back in the day. I don't think they really sell it anymore, but it is absolutely tiny. So I'll try and get it on camera here. It's pretty hard to see. You can see it's just rolling around in the scoop there. Try and get him out. Stick it in my finger. But you can sort of see how small it is. So yeah, the old monster, it's quite capable of finding incredibly small targets. So, yeah, I'll give you a little shot of the little diggings I'm doing here. So it's basically just this little um, throw out pile Old timers have um, dug all this area out and just tossed it up onto here. So, yeah, I've uh, now picked up yeah, three bits of gold off of this bit, but yeah, I'll keep wandering along and see if I can pick up a little bit more. Hey guys, um, just got a little signal here with the monster. It is tiny. Uh, I think I can see it. I'm not sure if it's gold. It might be, and I think it might be on the surface. So, I'll give you a look because my eyes can barely see it, but. Should be right at the tip of the scoop there. You can see it just in front of the tip of the scoop, just there. I was trying to get out and get in the scoop and we'll uh, have a bit of a look. Alrighty, if I dig it up, I think it's, I think it's sitting on the end of a little bit of quartz. in both ways. So um endeavor to get it out. I 
think I've got it. Oh, it is a bit of gold too. Oh my goodness, it's small. That was it, yeah, so it was sitting on top of the ground. It wasn't on quartz, it was just sitting there, but I'll uh, give you a look. I'll uh, try not to drop it. Actually, decent sort of size. It's just there. There you go. Another little one. So basically, that was a sunbaker. That's pretty cool. Alright guys, so basically I've walked the length of this now. The other one sort of came from about halfway up between here and the pick. So, it's only about five metres away, but yeah. So, I'll keep walking around here. Um, yeah, see what we can come up with, but yeah. Still got another, there's another mound off of this hole just on the other side there, so might head over there as well. Alrighty guys, hopefully catch you with another live dig very shortly. I'm saying 100% gold, so I'd like to think it's not, not iron. bit round and it is ah oh, there you go shot down oh, I got a little confident and all it's old mate lead shot there you go anyway a little bit of excitement all right guys I'll work over this and I might jump back on the old uh, GPX 4500 I think and have a bit of a zip around with that before we knock off for the day all right catch you with another one soon shot there you go guys that's target was 45 she's led small and round right. old mate lead shot there you go there you go probably a hot rod this one yep hot rod well there you go no worries guys. G'day guys, welcome back. Um, I didn't film this dig because I've dug about 30,000 uh, bits of uh, ironstone, but yeah. We uh, found ourselves a little tiny, 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 little bit of gold. So it is super duperly small, but you can see it there in the um, scoop, but yeah. Well guys, that's it for another episode of Pete's Gold Adventures. Um, I hope you enjoyed the episode. We certainly did enjoy making it. It's a good day out here. And yeah, no gold for the GPX, but the um, gold monster came through for us today and uh, yeah, picked up three sort of micro pieces, I suppose. Um, don't think it'll come to a whole lot, but yeah, no, it's uh, still fun. Uh, it's always good finding gold, no matter how big it is, but yeah, uh, she's certainly small, but uh, good fun. So um, yeah, if you liked the video, yeah, like, share and subscribe and um, hopefully we'll catch you soon on another episode of Pete's Gold Adventures. Cheers guys.